Ooh. Where's the receipt? Is the microphone plugged in? Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. Uh, today I have a pasta haul. So, I got a few things. I wanted to just get some different colors. I wanted more shadows, some lashes, so I'll go ahead and show you what I got and I will also give you some price ranges so you can go ahead and know what's affordable, what's not, but actually I think everything in this bag is pretty affordable, so let's just get right into it. First and foremost, I got the Voluminous Carbon Black L'Oreal by L'Oreal Paris. This is just like a must-have. I think it was like eight bucks. So we got that. And then I have never heard of this brand before, so I don't know how they're gonna work, but it is by Beauty Gems and it's called the Day to Night Palette and it's 60 piece eyeshadow collection. Guess how much I got this for? Just guess. Ten dollars. So it's making me a little weary, but Let's see. It comes just like that. They're actually really pretty colors. It has a mix of mattes and some ones that have like a sheer metallic finish to it. Let's see the pigmentation. Uh, this is like a brown red. Okay, so it's like a brown. It's not bad. All right, let's see. Ooh, this orange. I wanted the this specific palette. They had different options, I think, but I wanted this because it had a lot of fall colors. So, and that's one of the oranges, right? My hands are so pale. And let's do one of the shimmery ones. Let's do this really, really pretty. It's almost like a dark, dark emerald green. That's the green. So actually the pigmentation is pretty good. Um, we'll find out, we'll find out more when I use it in one of the videos, but so far so good. I like it. Let's move on to, let me get this makeup off my hands. Okay, next, it's got some good old fashioned hair clips. It was, I wanna say about three something for 12 of them. So that's a really good deal also. I got, the Fit Me Matte and Poreless in 222 True Beige. I want to say this one was like $9. I got it a little darker because this is going to be one that I'm going to be wearing out more, so I'll probably be bronzed anyways. Next, I got... So I was running low on my Laura Mercier Translucent Finishing Powder. And I wanted to find a more affordable one anyways because the Laura Mercier one can be a little pricey, so why not try something new? I still have a little left anyways in case I don't like this one. But it's the Maybelline Master Fix by Face Studio. It's a setting perfecting loose powder. And yeah, I think it's just translucent. Yeah, it's translucent powder. So there we go. I can show you that one. I want to say this one was, let's see, I can actually tell you because I have the receipt. Got it. So, never mind. This is the second receipt. But I want to say it was around $9. Sorry, guys. It wasn't more than 10 I know that. So then going on, I got another new makeup brand I haven't heard of before. It is Makeup Revolution. I think it's sad that it was started by a blogger, actually. So 
I just got their liquid eye primer and sealant because I wanted to try a new one, maybe see if it works. The weird thing about this is it's water. It's like a liquid. I don't know if it's focusing, but it's literally like a liquid. And it's a sealant, so you put it on before your eyeshadow like a primer, and it says the sealant uh, wear after your eyeshadow has been applied to seal your waterproof, to seal and waterproof your eyeshadow from what life throws at you. So it's two in one. So I don't know how that's gonna work, but we'll try it out soon. I also got, oh. I got some falsies because I have said in both my videos already that I don't use false lashes. I blah, 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 that I don't use false lashes, and I just thought why not give it a shot. There's a look I have in mind for it, so I got Ardell, like the Ardell ones, and it's a deluxe pack. So it got two pairs, and then it came with the applier and glue. These were only $5.99, so. Hopefully, they're good, considering I don't really use lashes. If they're not, and you don't see a video yet, comment and tell me if you know before I use them. All right, next, I got, of course, the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. I got it in the color Fair. This was $5.99, so that was a steal. This is such a good concealer. And this is definitely a steal because it's the exact same, basically, as the NARS. Definitely, if you don't have this in your makeup collection, go to the store and get it for six bucks. It's, it's great. You won't regret it. And then next, I got another concealer. And it's from NYX, or NYX, however you want to say it. I say NYX. It's called the Gotcha Covered um concealer yeah so it's waterproof also and i haven't opened this one yet so let's open it looks like that and i got this in i don't even know what color light so let's see how light it really is comes out kind of creamy that's my first impression of it Oh, all right, this is no joke. It is extremely creamy. Very thick, very thick. This will be great for matte looks. So I'm excited to use this. And then last two things I got are together. So I got the NYX Lingerie Lip, I think it's, they're, doesn't, they're, okay, they're just the lingerie, the lip lingerie. I think it's liquid lipstick. I'm not sure though. And it's this brown color. I'm trying to get this plastic off. Get off. I can't get, ha ha, gotcha. All right, so. It's in the color, it says 01, it's called Lipley. It's a matte color and it's this brown. So that's what it looks like. It's a literal matte brown, which I wanted because I have a nude color, but I don't have a brown, so that's nice. And last, I got a matching lip liner, hopefully. I don't know if it matches or not because I haven't opened it. Stupid sticker. Okay. They make these things so hard to open. It's like I bought it. Let me open it. Haha, -ha, I got half. I got the cap off. That's the most important part, right? Let's see if it matches. It does. It's a little darker, which I wanted. So 
soul focus. I wanted the little darker, so that's great. Ugh, I can't get the plastic off the cap. And that's it, guys. It wasn't a big haul today. I just got, you know, some necessities and some other, some colors I haven't had. So, and the lashes. Lashes are going to be the, uh, the big, the big thing for me. But basically, I just wanted to share with you because they are inspiring me. I have so many new looks going on in my head right now that I want to do. And if you liked this, please give me some feedback, comment down below. And if you aren't already a subscriber, please, please, please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys soon. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.